integral 4 to 9 dx by square root of 9 minus x into x minus 4. Now how to find the integration to this question? Important problem. First I write the given problem here. Given problem is equals to integral 4 to 9 1 by square root of 9 minus x into x minus 4 into dx. Now this is a given question. So simply to take the integration first of all we multiply the denominator values that is 1 by square root of just take the product here 9 into x 9x 9 into x 9x minus x into x x square now minus 4 into 9 minus 36 minus 4 into minus 6 plus 4x just multiply the values of the denominator now this is equals to integral 4 to 9 1 by square root of minus x square plus 13x minus 36 into dx now clearly this is in the form of 1 by square root of ax square plus bx plus c. So 1 by square root of ax square plus bx plus c means this is the type 1 problem of the integration. We apply the same processor to solve this problem. This is the type 1 problem in integration. Already we solved this type of problems. So applying the same concept. Now what is the processor to solve that problem? First taking the x square quotient value common from the total value of the denominator. So here what is x square quotient minus 1. So taking minus 1 common here. Then what we get minus of x square minus 13x plus 36 into dx. Now applying 2 by 2 to the middle value. This is the processor to solve the type 1 problem in the integration. So applying the same processor. What is the next step? Applying 2 by 2 to the middle value. So after taking the x square quotient common. Just we apply the term 2 by 2 to the middle value. And this is equals to integral 4 to 9 1 by square root of minus of. Now clearly this is in the form of a square minus 2ab. What is b value here? 13 by 2. So applying b square that is x square minus 2 into x into 13 by 2. This is in the form of a square minus 2ab. What is b value? 13 by 2. So applying 13 by 2 whole square. That is adding 13 by 2 whole square minus 13 by 2 whole square plus 36. Means just we apply the value 13 by 2 whole square to this expression like that. And this is equals to integral 4 to 9 1 by square root of minus of now observe that this total term is in the form of a square minus 2ab plus b square. What is the answer? a minus b whole square. That is x minus 13 by 2 whole square. Now taking the simplification of the constants. Now write the remaining two constants here. What are the constants? Minus 13 by 2 whole square plus 36. Now take the simplification at here. Now this is minus 169 by 4 plus 36. After taking LCM, it becomes minus 169 plus 144 by 3 and this is minus 2 by 4 and this is minus 25 by 4. So, in this place, we substitute the value 25 by 4. Since the simplification of the two constants is equals to here, minus 25 by 4, which implies, so this is equals to integral 4 to 9, 1 by square root of minus of x minus 13 by 2 whole square minus writing this term as the square term which becomes 5 by 2 whole square 5 by 2 whole square into dx 5 by 2 whole square that is equals to 25 by 4 and this is equals to integral 4 to 9 1 by square root of just applying the minus to these two terms multiplying these two terms by the minus sign and the first term is now 5 by 2 whole square minus x minus 13 by 2 whole square now clearly this is in the form of integral 1 by square root of a square minus x square dx and what is the answer to this formula sine inverse x by a so applying the formula so this is equals to 1 by square root of a square minus x square. So the formula is equals to sine inverse x by a. That is sine inverse. x is equals to x minus 13 by 2. And a is equals to 5 by 2. Where the limits are 4 to 9. Now after taking the LCM. Sine inverse of 2x minus 13 by 2 by 5 by 2. 
Now here 2 and 2 gets cancelled where the limits are 4 to 9. Substituting the limits value. So this is sine inverse of first substituting x is equals to 9. That is 2 into 9. 18 minus 13 by 5 minus substituting the second limit sine inverse taking 2 is equals to 4 8 minus 13 by 5 and this is equals to sine inverse of 5 by 5 minus sine inverse of minus 5 by 5 so sine inverse of 5 by 5 that is this is equals to sine inverse of 1 minus sine inverse of minus 1 that is sine inverse of 1 is equals to pi by 2 minus sine inverse of minus 1 is equals to minus pi by 2 that equals to pi by 2 plus pi by 2 pi by 2 plus pi by 2 is equals to pi therefore the answer is integral 4 to 9 1 by square root of 9 minus x into x minus 4 dx is equals to pi that's all most important sum for essay question, very very important. Just same model of the integration.